thanks to new and innovative technologies, we can change the world around us a little or a lot. Augmented reality, virtual reality, and mixed reality have hit the education space in a big way. And one of the most common questions we receive is, where our apps fall on the reality spectrum? In order to answer that, we're going to take a look at what the different types of realities are. Augmented reality, or AR, is when a computer-generated image is superimposed on your view of the real world. Augmented reality first hit the scene in the early 90s with Louis Rosenberg's invention of virtual fixtures, a system developed at the U.S. Air Force's Armstrong Laboratory. AR uses the cameras and smart devices, like phones and tablets, to add a virtual layer to your environment. Using the device as a window, you see your world as it is, but with a little extra. The mobile version of our general reference app, Human Anatomy Atlas, has augmented reality capabilities built in. This allows users to project anatomy and virtual dissection lab simulations into the real world. AR is currently the most readily available way to alter reality. It doesn't change your world quite like VR does. Virtual reality, or VR, is different from AR in that it's a total immersion in a simulated environment. To immerse yourself, you'll need the proper equipment. VR is often projected through a head-mounted display that immerses users into a virtual world, eliminating the barrier presented by an external object, such as a tablet or a smartphone. In VR, the computer uses sensors to locate the position of the user's eyes within a simulated environment. If the user turns their head, the graphics respond accordingly. As of right now, VR hasn't quite caught up with our dreams of creating an interactive, immersive anatomy dissection. But that's not to say it won't happen someday soon. You'll just have to stay tuned and find out. Mixed reality, or MR, is exactly what it sounds like. It encompasses both AR and VR. Creating a space where digital and physical objects interact in real time. Microsoft's HoloLens is a pair of mixed reality glasses that scans the surrounding environment and accurately combines digital objects with those that are already present. ZSpace is a mixed reality system popular in K-12 spaces that combines elements of virtual and augmented reality in a computer. Consisting of three user-responsive components, a stereoscopic display, a stylus, and glasses, ZSpace allows users to interact with simulated objects in virtual environments as if they were real. This is another reality in which we operate. We threw a lot of information at you just now, so let's recap. Virtual reality immerses users in a simulated environment. Augmented reality adds a virtual layer to the environment. And mixed reality combines the two. So virtual and physical objects interact. Just as these reality-altering technologies blur the line between what is real and what is virtual, so do the terms used to describe them. And who knows what future innovations are coming down the road. After all, reality is what you make of it. <laughs>